The controversy surrounding the construction of a megachurch in Lutherville comes to an end, making protesting residents in the area happy. WJZ's Live Marcus Washington has more on the decision to not build and what's next. Marcus? Well, Denise Grace Fellowship had plans to build a 78,000 square foot church. Now, many people who live in that area were complaining about it, but the church leadership says that is not the reason why they decided not to build. It is near this busy intersection of Seminary Avenue and Falls Road in Lutherville that nearby residents say is no place for a proposed 78,000 square foot megachurch. That size project, which is a wonderful idea as far as the church is concerned, was certainly not meant for that particular location right down the street from us. And for 11 months, Garland McPherson, along with more than 4,000 of his neighbors, protested Grace Fellowship building the large scale church on the 21 acres in this wooded area claiming the project was too large, would strain the water well, cause environment and traffic problems. Recently, an announcement from church leaders. Today, we want to inform you that after a long and thorough process, including much prayer and counsel, we've decided that it is in our church's best interest to end this process and to pursue a site other than Seminary Avenue. On the church's webpage, the lead elder cites growth within the congregation as to why they're not building at this current location. That growth, roughly 300 members, would make it hard for zoning when it comes to parking. We believe that the Lord has something better for us, and the prudent thing to do is to move away from the Seminary Avenue land option. The decision, a victory for many residents against the construction, but McPherson says they have good hopes for Grace Fellowship Church. That they do find a location that's right for them, and in fact, they can serve their community more. And Garland says he actually became friends with many people at the church during this process. As far as a new location picked, that has not been announced. We are live tonight. I'm Marcus Washington, WJZ Eyewitness News. All right, thank you, Marcus. Now, WJZ tried to reach Grace Fellowship Church, but our calls have not been returned.